Hey, what is up everybody? It's me, Hadi Tire here today. Brand new video. It is Eid 2022 here in Michigan. And I'm gonna show you what that's like here in the United States. Let's get it. About to head to the masjid right now. Pretty excited, 2022 Eid. So we're about to go to the masjid and read our Eid Salah. Uh, it is at nine o'clock uh, in the morning time. And then we're gonna go have breakfast at our cousin's house. All right, so we're on the way right now. You get to see a lot of people that you don't see throughout the year. And obviously COVID, because of that, a lot of people you haven't seen in multiple years. Uh, so I'm pretty excited to see everyone. A lot of my friends are gonna be there. So for those who don't know what Eid is, it's basically a feast, a celebration that we have after the month of Ramadan, where we fast for 30 days. It's a good celebration. We uh, pray together and um, afterwards we go out, see our family members give each other gifts and stuff and something we look forward to every year all right so we're about to be pulling up here to the masjid the the clothes i'm wearing right now i got a shabar kurta and i have on a pakhol which is the hat i'm wearing which is very popular in northern pakistan look at the shades i don't Sometimes I wear the shades. They look kind of nice. Should be packed. Should be a lot of people. There's police officers helping out because there's so many people. And uh, big shout out to them for helping the community out. Right now, it doesn't look full. That is definitely going to be full real soon. Yeah, we got school buses. Uh, there's a new school here. All right, so we just pulled up. About to enter right now. All right. Here we are, Masjid Umar bin Khattab. You're gonna see people wear their best clothes that they have. Uh, a lot of people are gonna wear ethnic clothing. Very common. It's not even on. It's not even on. It's on, Hassan. Followers, 
ice, ice, the ice. Oh, Don't ice forget the ice. Right, I'm out. UBK, UBK. Hold this hot. Yes, sir. Great time seeing everyone. A lot of old faces. It's good seeing after a long time. All right, so we just wrapped up our Eid Lamaz, Eid Salah. To head over and do breakfast at my cousin's house. Very much excited for that. Always. What's the vibe? Vibe is good. Vibe's fantastic. Always. But I want to see if the food's better than the vibe. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My boy Mustafa, he's a little shy guy though. So don't worry about him. Kramai, as we saw earlier, is now apron. Bye. <laughs> Got Akramai's apron by right now, mashallah. Omelette is made, puriya is made, parathe is made. Every year, alhamdulillah, at, after Eid Namaz, we go to Akramai's house for nashta, breakfast. This is what Eid is all about, family, traditions, family values, everything coming together. Tired. That's another thing with Eid though, I always get tired every single year. Even if I get full night of sleep, which like never happens at Eid, I'm always tired. It's time to eat though. The eggs, the under. The eggs, the under. The eggs, the under. Uh, it's called chole. Sorry, the chole. What is it? And then we got the kima, ground beef. Yeah, puriya, mashallah. Parate, parate. This is the part you don't record. Musta being shy with his own cousins from Chicago, my boy Aman. Aman, what do you want to say to the people? He's got AP test. Go pass it. What test? What test? He asked. What test? Oh, because that's a tough, tough test. Fives only though. Fives only. So we just got done eating nashta breakfast here at my cousin's house. Really happy with how everything went. My stomach is very thankful too. Time to go to the crib. Good food, good vibes, always. Big thank you to Cousin Akramai. Everything's been good so far. Got to see some family, some friends, which is always good. Beautiful trees. Uh, the weather's getting a little better. By a little better, I mean like 50 degrees. You fasted for 30 days and now you can just eat, do whatever so, you want. Does it feel weird? Uh, a big misconception is that when we fast, it like messes with our body and it's, it's like a negative thing. But honestly, the whole experience is a positive effect and impact on our lives. They always think about the food and all that, but the main thing is that you mentally become stronger uh, for the rest of the year. And that's a 